Hello friends, hola amigos. Today I'm going to show you this TPMS solution from Cozy Life. Welcome to this new video. So Cozy Life sent me this product to show it on my channel. But as always, I give you my honest opinion. So in this small little box, you have four sensors that you can put on any car that doesn't have TPMS sensor. So what does this mean? TPMS sensor stands for tire pressure measure sensor. So this sensor measures the pressure of your tire and can see if you have flat tires or not. So almost all new cars have this but on older cars you don't have this solution and you have to check it manually at the gas station so let's see what's in the box as always we have the manual with clear instructions it says that you can choose between the cozy life app that you can see here but you can also use the car home app or the tpms app so test them out, see what is best for you. You can see the content of the box, installation instructions and so on. In the box itself, we have the tools. So it is really simple, straightforward. You have one key and four bolts. Those bolts are anti-theft. So to avoid that your sensors are being stolen. So the sensors themselves have numbers on them. The battery should hold up for about two or three years. And of course they can stand every condition like snow, water, car wash. That's no problem at all. So of course, be sure to keep this key in your car because if you have a flat tire and you need to add some air into your tires, you need this key to remove the anti-theft bolts so in the manual you can clearly see where every sensor goes so number one goes on the front left two three and four now this is as simple as removing the old the, removing the old cap put the anti-theft bolts in place And now, as this is the front left, we have to put sensor number one on top. You can see the inside of the cap. And there you go. And now we have to replace the anti-theft bolt there you go so in order to tighten the anti-test screw you really have to use both hands keep this cap in one hand and screw the other one with your hand on top i think when you remove the sticker it will be more discreet so as you can see the valves are quite big now let's do the other sensors as well and then we can connect them to the application. So the back wheel is done as well. You can see they are really prominent. But that's depending on the valve that is used because here you can see it's a long valve. And if I go back to this side, you can see that the valve is way shorter. Now with all the sensors on, I'll remove the stickers to make them a little bit less visible and attractive for thieves. So now they look more like huge but normal sensors. Now remove the stickers from the sensors and from a distance nothing can be noticed that hard. Look closer you'll see that the caps are quite big and especially on the back wheel where the valve is 
quite long, it sticks out. So here, this could be a problem when hitting the sidewalk, but we will see. So once the sensor is well secured with the anti-theft bolts, you can't remove the sensor itself. You can remove the cap and then you can see the inside and you even can see the battery. So I suppose that you can change the battery yourself as well. But they can't steal the sensor itself. So if you want to remove the cap in order to blow your tires a little bit, you have to use the key to undo the bolt. With this done, we can connect the sensors to the application itself. Now we downloaded the Cozy Life app. We created an account and then we select plus outdoor life. And here we have the TPMS option. Team one, okay. And now we can simply click and it should connect itself within the 60 seconds. It finally connected to all the four tires. I had to retry it a lot of times. I think per tire I had to try it 15 times before it connected. I killed the application, I killed my Wi Fi Bluetooth connection. Uh, but after all, just keep on trying and then it will connect. Then the application itself is a little bit fiddly as well. Uh, I can change like the name of the of the application and here I see some translations errors as well I can install vibration alarm here I can set which measurements I want to have but as you can see here it is completely blank and this is in Chinese so you really have to guess what, what you're choosing No idea how I did it, but I did it. Now, above and below alerts, and that's about it. So for 16 euros, you can add TPMS to any car that you like. It is a li little bit fiddly to set up, but once it is set up, it does work and it is handy to see what kind of pressure you have on your tires. So. Let me know in the comments what you think about this. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And I'll see you in the very next video. Bye bye.